YouTube, welcome back to my channel. It's me, Kat, and today I am going to go over the two new Milani palettes, the, what are they called? The, uh, I got the Gilded Violet and the Gilded Jade Hyper Pigmented Eye and Face Palette. So it is a eyeshadow and highlighter palette. I will show you the insides of them. This is the Jade one. Obviously, it's all green. I'll do swatches. And then this one is the purple one. It's more of a mix of purples, pinks, uh, peaches, and blues. But this is the purple palette. And then um, I'm gonna, I got as a sample size this mascara, so we'll give that a try. And um, yeah, let's see how good these palettes are. So I did prime my eyes. It came, um, I have this um, Milani eyeshadow primer. It came with a palette that I ordered. So we're going to, sorry, I'm just looking for a, okay, I've got something I can wipe my brushes off if I have to. So I guess I'm going to start with the uh, purple one. I haven't used uh, this um, palette. I've swatched a few colors, but that's it. So I'm going to swatch the highlight colors. There's Seeing Stars, and it's Delicate. Seeing Stars is this white micro, or it's like um, a white with a pink um, micro glitter shift and then we have this one which is a metallic one okay then we have the um, we have the eyeshadows let me go row by row so the first row we have your majesty very Violet and Past Curfew. So let me swatch them. Okay, that one. I think Past Curfew is very chalky. Yeah, that color past curfew, it's pretty, but it is very chalky, and those are the other colors. This is Your Majesty, and then Very Violet. And then the next row, we have No Angel, Kiss Kiss, and Deep End. So let me switch. Okay, that's not a uh, pressed glitter completely. I thought that one shadow was a pressed glitter, but it's not. It's got a base with it. So that is the second row of eyeshadows. Very pretty and pigmented. pigmented. The mattes are um, very powdery. I'm noticing. So the last row we have Heavy Petal, Melodrama, and Full Moon. So two mattes and then this kind of micro shimmer duochrome, uh, duochrome kind of color. So the heavy petal color is kind of close to my skin tone. And then 
full moon is the color right there, which is kind of like the highlight. So I don't know why they put those two colors in there, but um, I'm sure they had their reasons. So that's the um, purple, and then the green palette, we have Aura an amber glow as the highlights. Aura is a gold um, micro glitter. And then we have amber glow, which is like um, an amberish highlight. So those are the two colors. With the highlights, it seems like you're getting one... Um, my, uh, micro glitter and one metallic. I guess the micro glitter is supposed to be a topper. Okay, so the first row we have grounded, try me, and mint julep. So that is the first row. Um, grounded is that color, mint julep, and then that is, no, sorry, this is mint julep, and this is try me. And then we have the next row, which we have the envy of, gilded, and lagoon. These are all gorgeous shimmers. Lagoon is my favorite. It's this micro glitter one. And then that is um, the Envy. No, this is Gilded. And this is the Envy of. And then we have the last row, which is all mattes. So we have Edible. That's Deep and Jaded. Those, the dark green one is very um, powdery, so that's the last three colors. So we have edible, which is the brown color, that is, that's deep, and jaded is that color. So that is all of the all of the um, highlights and um, eyeshadows that you get. So let me put the highlights on first because I love a good highlight. Um, let me use this. So I guess this side is going to be the pink purple side and this side's going to be the green side. So we're going to go in first with It's Delicate. That's a really pretty highlight. And you could definitely make that blinding because I put a very light coating on. So you can make it a light, you know, bling, and then you can definitely amp it up. Let me do one more. There you can see. And then I'm going to take Seeing Stars and put it just right on the highest point of my cheek, which I don't really think does anything. If you layer them, in my opinion, I don't think layering them does anything. If you want the Seeing Stars one to show up, um, 
use a setting spray with it. Okay, now let me use the green. So, Amber's Glow. This might be a little too dark. Yeah. This is very dark for me. Have to blend it out very well. Uh, blend it out. It does blend very well, so it is workable. And then let me take Aura and pat that just right on the high point. Again, I don't know if it's doing anything because these highlights are so metallic. But that's what they look like. So now let's just do uh, an eye look. So I'm going to start with the green. I'm going to take my crease brush. And I'm going to go in with mint julep as kind of a um, crease color. Or, sorry, um, transition color. So I don't want a heavy coating of this. I have worn this green palette, and you can wear the um, mint julep color darkened, but I just want to use it as a transition right now okay and then I'm gonna take the color jaded which is powdery second packing of the color on seems to be doing the trick and then just do a blending There we go. The green is looking more vibrant in person. So I'm gonna pack I took a mix of That's Deep which is really powdery. Oh, and these palettes cost um, $19.99 each, but I used um, a code where I got 10% off. I found the code online, so you can find tons of code online. Or I used this app, Honey, I've been using recently, and they will find whatever code exists for... Um, a company you're buying from, so I would try them out. Didn't mean to make the green go so high, so you do have to be careful with that, with the, um, with the, um, darker matte colors. So now I'm going to take on the eye... I'm going to take that gilded color. I'm going to do it with my finger because those felt like colors that should be patted on, yeah.
I put the green on and then I'm going to take that lagoon color. I'm going to take a flat brush and do that on the inner corner. Okay, that seems to be working. So what is up with all of these influencers abusing animals? There's that girl who just got caught hitting her dog and spitting on it, which that's just, you know, she's a winner for that. Um, and then that girl on Twitch who threw her cat and then gave her cat vodka to drink. And cats can have liver and renal failure very easy because their organs are so freaking tiny. It's like people are just getting these animals because they think it's cool. And then the horrible thing is, well, I mean, it's great if they take the animal out, but then because it's been mistreated or, um, it's an older animal, then, you know, people don't want to take it. And there's already a bunch of animals that, that are homeless that need, you know, homes. So it's a very, you know, uh, tough situation. So this is what the, uh, green eye looks so far. And I'm just going to take that color try me and do it right under my eye. And then I'm going to take that aura color and stick it in the inner tear duct. So that's the green eye and I'm going to do the other eye now. Um, so what I'm going to do is take that heavy petal color and use that as a transition in the eyeball. This will just get everything covered quickly. Yeah, that heavy petal color is very close to my skin tone. Okay, and then I'm going to take... I'm going to take the color... Kiss, kiss, and put that into the crease. Okay, let's take this color and pack it into the crease. Pack it on again. Okay. There we go. Now 
nice and blended. Now let me just pack in some color. Okay. And now I'm going to take, I'm going to take, hmm, hmm, hmm. I'm gonna take your majesty and go all over the eyeball with my finger. The heat wave in New York is finally breaking. I can do my uh, makeup without it melting off my face in two minutes again. Okay, I accidentally got a little red on my mole. But that mole will be gone soon. And then I'm going to take deep at, now I'm going to take full moon and pat that in the center or all over do it again Not bad, not bad. And then I'm going to take the color No Angel and put it on my brow bone since I actually have room to do it. So let's take No Angel. Go on the brow bone. I do like these palettes. You do have to build up the color a little bit, but I don't think it's the end of the world. I've worked with high-end palettes that were a lot shittier than these ones, and you can get them for $19.99, I'm sh and at Walmart they sell them in store, so I'm sure you can get them cheaper there, and you can always use coupons to get them cheaper. So let's try this mascara. I am going to do a full face of Milani, because I have other palettes and blushes and highlight palettes and stuff I want to try from them. But, ooh, I like this mascara. I am a fan so far, as long as this doesn't flake. I like. It's not clumping. Coats the lashes really easy. I am a fan of this mascara. It came as a sample with an order I made. And I am digging it. The name of the mascara is the Highly Raiden Mascara, and this is what the mini looks like, and I definitely recommend it, and I recommend the palettes too. Um, the lipstick I'm wearing is from Milani. It is their 
um, matte um, lipsticks, and it's in 64 Orchard Matte. Do a little hand swatch for you. That's what it looks like, but it looks darker because I have underneath it this um, Hypnotic Lights color from Milani. So it's darkened it up just a little bit. Um, so I will leave all the products down below. I will leave lists to um, uh, all the products also. And let me know if you think you want to get these palettes. The only one I didn't get was the warm tone one because I have a ton of warm tone palettes. I am over them. And yeah, I uh, just didn't want to get the warm tone palette, so I didn't get that. Um, tomorrow's video is going to be fun because I actually was able to get the Jackie Ina palette. So I will be doing swatches, a uh, review, and uh, well, I haven't used it yet except one color that duochrome color and it's amazing so um can't wait to show you guys that palette and i have a ton of makeup that's um showing up that i ordered i got the jeffree star collection with morphe i got the brush set with that i got stuff from sugar pill i got their um, summer collection. I got their singles and some of their liquid lipsticks. Um, I still have to do the Jawbreaker collection. I'm a little behind. I got the new Juvia's Place. So I got a lot of stuff for you guys. And um, now with the heat wave breaking, I can actually film for you guys again so let me know what you think of the palettes in the um comments down below and if you think you're gonna get any of them and uh yeah or what you think of milani um i love that they're cruelty free so big thumbs up for that and um yeah, just let me know what you think of the palettes or Milani, and I will see you tomorrow when we play with the Jackie Ina palette, and I have a giveaway I'm going to be doing during that video. So I will see you guys tomorrow, and have a good night, and see you in the next one. Night, YouTube. Bye.